What is up, my crazy divine Koreans? My name's Vrako, you can call me V, and welcome back to The Isle. Today's episode is, well, we're going to try the official server. Uh, so no more test server where we muck around and have fun. No more, um, well, not finding anyone. I've got a good, confident feeling we're going to find someone, which is famous last words. But nonetheless, we're going to play a juvenile Triceratops female, and we're going to glitch through the world, apparently. Potentially make the game break. Oh, oh, hello. <laughs> oh, we're loaded in. And what terrifies me is I think we might be in an area where carnivores spawn, or where everyone spawns. This looks too familiar to me. I'm not going to try and swim across that. Um, we're just going to have a little wonder. Finding people is so hard. Find bushes to eat. Okay, well, I'll do that in a minute. I'm going to go drink some water first, and then we're going to have a bush to eat, I think. Playing a herbivore. Makes it a little bit easier to find food. Oh my god, his waddle is amazing. Oh, I love it. Yeah, so guys, if you have enjoyed the aisle so far, make sure you do smash the like button. If you haven't already, do subscribe so you can join my crazy beautiful Vlad Kevin's. Don't know why I did that part in quiet, because the next part's a secret. Can I? I want drink. I want... Oh, kitty's meowing. No, no. Um, But yeah, if you want to join the special forces, then make sure to turn on notifications so you can join the early... Notification squad. Okay, I can't drink from that water. I think that's official. In which case, let's have a look at our character quickly. So we are in the juvenile. We're not a hatchling. Uh, we have got a little bit of health. We've got loads of health. I don't remember that. No stamina, basically. Well, that's a lie. We've got loads. Uh, food and water we're good for. So, you know what I'm going to do this time? I think I'm just going to wander around the coast. Because, hear me out here. I think we're going to find some... Those are my footprints. I was like, oh, oh it's not someone else. Oh, I know. <laughs> I don't think I'm ever going to find someone. Which I guess for a game like this isn't necessarily a bad thing, but I want to find a friend. I have a terrifying feeling my friend will not be a friend. It will be something that's going to kill me. I wish I could play Therizinosaurus because OP. And if something did pose a threat, they'd know that I'm business, because I has claws. I'm a claw boy. Um, instead, I'm a horn boy. And, well... Ah, oh, look, the Trace Horny Boys. Ah! It's a yeah, reference to the Adventure Zone, an amazing podcast I absolutely adore about Dungeons and Dragons. Three brothers and their dad play it, to be exact. Um, it's great to listen to when you're awake, when you're falling asleep. Oh, it's, just, it's just a beautiful podcast. Anyway, let's go ahead and completely break what I was saying about running alongside the coast. Can I crouch with this dude? Nope. Apparently not. I can sprint, which is nice. Hello. Anybody there? Let's try again. Hello. That's me saying hello, apparently. And, oh, we have the Aurora Borealis. We're getting lit up quite nicely. However, if we went into night vision mode, we can see all the little spots on him. Oh, he's so cute. Oh, Your eyes are just haunting. The haunted Triceratops is definitely going to be the thumbnail. <laughs> Unless, well, we see something funny, but I'm not trying to throw shade, but I think we might not because, well, I'm going to be on my own again. Join the official server. Still nobody here. Why is this happening to me? <laughs> Let's find out. I can go global chat. Hello. Hey, 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 hey. Hello. Global chat is disabled on this server. Wow, they meant it when they meant official, didn't they? Let's go to... Whoa. <laughs> Don't know if you can hear the banging. What am I doing? Get up. Why am I stuck? Um, I don't know what I did. Control and enter, and then maybe try again. No, okay. Let's log out, and we'll go straight back to the same server. Don't worry. But yeah, if you could have a little bang, I think there's, we've got like a little notice board in the um, hallway at the moment that we've been meaning to take down, and um, a kitty keeps scratching it and then trying to climb it, and it falls. Down, because that kitty's not very smart. I think it was this one. Confirm. I see that the fact that host is in green, in a green box, and I, nine times out of ten, go to click on it, which just isn't good for me. Um. Oh, God. 
Right, well, we're going to find out what the controls are. So I can get out of being stuck. Move left, crouch, jump, sprint, trot, turn in place. Fire, alternative fire. Dinosaurs, voice, build nest, scent. Um, other. So player list is tab. Change stance is J. Might be J. Let's try to get J a chance. Um, so J. Nope. I might be stuck. Control. Z. X. C. B. B. N. M. Not N, obviously. L. J. K. Nope, nope. Okay. What was it I pressed? Oh, H. It's H for holler at me because I'm an idiot. Well, duly noted. That's also going to be really, really interesting to know because. <gasps> Can I eat? Can I eat these? No, I can't. Let's get my scent on. Have I got my scent on? Sniffing. <gasps> He's like a bulldog, but with three horns and a reptile. I love it. Okay, right. Come on, boy. Where's that scent at? You're taking quite some time. Here we go. Right, so. That's my footprints. Fortunately. <laughs> Something that comes up from behind and doesn't say hello first is more than likely going to try and eat me. Oh god. This is... This is riveting gameplay because it requires me to talk a lot more than you. Actually, no, Jurassic World Evolution, I have to do that. And Jurassic World the game. But, like, I don't know, just talk about things, I guess. Like, whilst looking out on the ocean. Oh, such a romantic I am, aren't I? I do spoil you guys and girls. Let's have a look a little over this. Can I see over it? Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. Cool. Can't eat this either, can I? Nope. So I guess I've got a target specific bushes as well. So this whole me thinking if I play a herbivore it'll be easier to eat. It's wrong. Okay. Do your snaff thing. No? You, you take quite some time to sniff, don't you? And it doesn't even last that long, which makes it just suck. Just shut. I regret picking a Triceratops now. Should have gone for like a Raptor or something. I could have got around a lot quicker. Food would have been difficult, but... But... See, look, there's a butt there. <laughs> no, but seriously. This is torture. Where are all the hoes at? Where are all the dinosaurs at? Guys, come on. This is nuts. Right, um... <laughs> Looks like I've done a circle. I know I haven't, but it just feels like it. Where does everyone go in these servers? Like, it's just... I'd rather... In fact, actually, let's do something I know I'm going to enjoy looking at. Achievements. Where? Where's... Where's the... There's no achievements? Really? But... I, they must be. Maybe it just... Because in some games, for some reason, it does that. It doesn't show me the achievements, which annoys the living hell out of me. Because it means I have to unlock them, come back in, and on the fourth, and it's just like, ugh. Oh. Well, I could have just viewed them on my phone at the same time, I guess, but... Oh, well. Okay, making my way back to you, babe. I'm inside a Triceratops' butt. That's kind of haunting. And... Oh, no, I've gone and I turned round. I didn't realise I'd turn around if I did that. Trying to get inside your face when you did it. Ha <laughs> Got you. By pressing S, which would be going backwards, I can get keep him going that way. Right, lovely. <laughs> He's like, I'm not going to look at you. No, no. He's got the eyes of a parrot mixed with a fish. Ugh. Now that would be something. I wonder what it tastes like. Parrot mixed with... Or like a bird mixed with a fish. Hmm. Like chicken, but... Salmon, oh. Like chicken texture, but salmon taste. <gasps> or salmon texture, but chicken taste, because you can't have raw chicken. So that'd be an interesting one, wouldn't it? Contrary to popular belief, you should not eat raw white meat. It's not good for you. However, you can eat raw fish. I mean, certain raw fish. And when I say raw, I don't mean jumping in the ocean and getting it, because shock horror, you might get bitten back. Believe it or not. Okay, well... Just gonna check my surroundings and have a quick sniff of doodles. 
see what we can find after the, you know, the next five minutes of just utter sniffing. It's a good 30 or so seconds before you, you finish sniffing, isn't it? Yeah, it's not that. It's about 10, but 10 to 15, I'd say, maybe. But hey, right, we've gone, I think, far enough around the coast for me to not give a damn anymore that I'm going in inside because maybe I'll come across someone. Maybe I'll come across a friend. Maybe I won't. Maybe come across against a carnivore, which is more likely to happen than a friend, because everyone wants to play the carnivore, which is what I did first time, and still found no one. Come on, I want food and water. Kind of a requirement. Like, even real me wants food and water. Can't confirm that much. Can't sniff and move, which sucks. So, herbivores have a major disadvantage. They're not as cool. They're easier to die. And they're easier to get killed. And they can't sniff on the move. There's got to be some form of incentive to playing them. Maybe they grow bigger quicker. Who knows? Maybe they have more food, even though that's clearly not the case. Who knows? I can't even eat these damn flowers or berries or whatever they are, which annoys me. But this is a perfectly good bush. Eat the damn bush. Eat the damn bush. You're not going to eat the damn bush. Right, okay. Anything I need to look at? Nope. No water or food in sight. Yay me. Oh. oh. I still haven't put my headphones on. And this is the third episode I'm recording. So. Yeah. Well, that's sinking. That's sinking side. Oh. No, those aren't dinosaurs. Those are just bushes. God damn it. Not even the bushes I can eat. When I want an ominous, overlooking thing, I want it to be either edible, or a threat, or a friend. So, the Tef rule, threat, edible, or friend, you know? But no, or the Fet rule, or the ETF rule, I don't know, I, I don't know. But basically, something that's interesting, so the eye rule, the eye rule's probably better. Oh, the moon, you can see it moving. Take that, Flat Earthers. <laughs> ah, that's... Get a good lay of the land. Why am I going so damn slow? Oh, my bad. Take a bit of a rest then. That's it, boy. You have a little rest to do. Let's see how terrifying you are in night vision. Oh, shell haunting. Oh, the Aurora Borealis in black and white. The Aurora Borealis is gone? Oh, no. Oh, clouds. Oh, this does get stamina back a lot quicker. I'm looking out for any shiny eyeballs. Anything at all? Nope. Right then. I'm curious, if I was to log out, like, does my character stay here? Is that how this game works? I don't know. Well, let's get up and go for a little bit of a jog. Come on. Morning jog. Or day jog. A nighttime jog. Directly night. I, I don't know. The, the clouds are that bad at this moment in time. I also realise you guys might not be able to see it if I, unless I turn this on, so I'm sorry. But I, I can see it quite clearly, so I'm really hoping Action, my recording studio, that, uh, recording studio, recording software that I use, is allowing you to see. Oh, you should be able to see now. Uh, maybe not. The Aurora Borealis is gone again. Come back. I want to summon you again. <laughs> uh, my god, we, we regained a lot of stamina very quickly to then splurge it very slowly. So that's not bad. Anybody. Anybody a boot? There we go. Hopefully someone will come back with, oh, I'm not a boot, but I can kill you. And I'll be like, yay, the sweet release of death from this corporeal form that is just flabby. The more I run, the more and more I wish that like, toning was a thing in this game. Like, I'd have a super rip Triceratops. Yeah, I'm going to turn light vision on that because it's getting dark for me. Um, like a Triceratops, like a 12-pack or something on its back. That would be some sheer muscle mass right there. All right. I'll bite. Let's have a quick little sniff of doodles. I can't smell anything. Can he? Maybe some food would be great. I've got to turn night vision off to properly acknowledge anything in my area. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything. Night vision goes back on. Oh yeah, look at my little footprints that I leave. Oh, that's cute. I keep saying it like it's something new every time, but I, I, I realised in episode one, like ten minutes in, that it was my footprints, and I was like, oh, there's someone about, and ran in circles and realised that it was not someone about. 
it was just my feetsies. And they stank. That's the reason it's leaving them, because they stank. They properly stank, apparently. Okay. Anybody a boot? Nope. Oh, oh, I thought it was glowing. I was like, oh, it's eyes. It's not eyes. It's a rock. That's like how depressing this game can be, that you want to see something and you don't. And then so much so that you're like, you know what? I think I'll play, you know, a herbivore. So I think, oh my God, I'm literally blending in. That's nuts. I'll play a herbivore so I can find people. Nope. Um, and then you get to the point of utter realization that you're, you're willing to lay down and die or find something that can kill you just so that you have some form of social interaction. Which is a terrifying, terrifying thought in reality. But in this game, pretty standard. And get your fat buck back. Oh, there we go. That's going to be enough stamina for now. All right. Now use your fat buck to wiggle and run. Or I should say waddle. How am I doing growth-wise? Yeah. Growth, 85%. Lovely. Malnourished. And thirsty. Oh, God. Health's going to drop soon, then, I presume. I would love to eat. Not going to lie. There's some bushes right there. Apparently, it's not even food. Look at this. Watch. Going over here. What is clearly a bush made of plants. And nope. Can't eat it. I also wonder if, like, sprinting makes my hunger and stuff go down. But... Up, sorry, my hunger go up and my, my, my food level down, I guess, is what I was looking for. But, quite frank, I don't care because I need food. <laughs> to find food, I have to run around the place. And to make sure I'm not sitting in one place, would you believe it? I want to run because I don't like going really slow, which is really, really slow. So, yes, I'm going to run. Let's have a quick look at it. I can kick? Oh, I guess that's a vote to kick. I have a high ping. Oh my lord, I have such a high ping. But then again, this is a US server. I'm not in the US. Spoiler alert. Um. Well. I'm making yawn because this is taking a while. And because the dark sort of like tones in this video, or this game I should take like for the video, are making me quite sleepy. Concerningly sleepy. I haven't eaten. I need to do stuff around the house. Oh, I've got loads of things to do after this video. I can record more later. And potentially more on Tuesday. Yes, it sounds like a plan. Oh! There we go. We're all aboard Alice's back. And it's gone. <laughs> oh, dear me. Right, cute. Get your sniff on. Come on. Let's find something. Let's find something, oh my god. <laughs> Part of me is knowing that the next time I do a video on this, I'm just going to have to find something, and then, once I found something, then start recording. But my god, this is a journey, it's an adventure of this little triceratops that could. I mean, to be fair, in a very short period of time, this triceratops can be the triceratops that couldn't breathe, walk, or, you know, live because he's going to die of hunger and thirst. But for now, she, I think, actually, is the, she is the little triceratops that could, but won't be shortly. So that sucks. But, you know, let's just keep waddling in a very fast manner. And then we'll at some point lay down and die, I'm sure. I'm not even properly inland. I'm still on the, like, the island that's around the coast, so... Need to head in this direction, I guess. Oh, what is that? In the distance, it looks like a... What is it? It's like a dome? Maybe even a... a roller coaster? I don't know. I'm legitimately curious now. Uh, what have we got to deal with? Um, let's queue it up. You want to go, apparently? I'm yawning. Oh, Lord. 100%. Amazing gameplay footage for you guys right now. 
I, I'm, not, I'm not mocking the game. I really do love it. It's such a unique and niche concept that I do love. But, my god. Make the island smaller. Or just allow people to find more people. Or just add a metric ton of AI because at this point, phew, I think I've played this game for like nearly two hours now, give or take, and the only people I have found are people who I have found, well, you know, in a server dedicated to fighting each other with about a, you know, 100 meter radius, so, eh, that could be why. I found them. Um, let's try again. Hello? Question mark. <laughs> Nobody's typing. If anyone is about, they're either too ingrained or just don't don't care for me. Or third and foremost, more than likely, there's no one about. Why can't I sprint? There we go. I was pressing the wrong button. Oh yeah, here comes the slow but painful and obviously assured death. That we've all been waiting for. I know I could have respawned at any time. I'm aware of this, guys. However, I I'm, I'm pretty intent on following it through. This little guy, seeing what we can get done for him whilst we can. There we go. Uh, there we go. Unfortunately, I can't move again. Oh, I can. I was pressing the wrong button. Again. <laughs> Shock horror. Shock horror. Um, uh, this is just painful. <laughs> Let's get a little wander on and see what we can find. Here we go. Let's have a look. Oh, that's definitely a dome, it looks like. Um, I'm not seeing any food or water. Fortunately, we're only going to die of hunger first. Hunger as in first is in one ST, not as in thirst as in thirsty, which we're also going to die of at some point. I'm fully aware. This is painful. This is painful. This is so painful. He's <laughs> making me hungry. I'm holding down Q. Why are you not sniffing? I thought he was, and I realised he wasn't until I... You are definitely doing it now because I'm trying to press W to go forwards and it won't let me, so that must mean you are sniffing. Right. I found water. Which is at least... It's a start. Let's not deny that it's not a start because it is a start. Oh, it's raining now. I mean, we've got lots of water now. Yeah, no. Call it a hunch. But I think old Tricy, the Triceratops, isn't going to make it. I mean, to be fair, are we surprised? No. Are we disappointed? Yes, because I built quite a bond with this little fella. Or fellette, I should say. Little lady. Um, oh, little lady is a bit of a trope in a derogatory term. I'm not going to say that. No. Um, I don't know what to call you. We'll just call you Tricy. Anyway, let's go, Tricy. You can get some water if you really, really run for it. Oh, that looks like water. Oh, it's not. It's, I thought it was like a flowing water, but it's not. It's just, once again, the side of a freaking cliff that I climbed to find food or water. Alright, let's find stuff again. I'm going to reply to a message. Uh, no, I can't reply to it, unfortunately. I can only see it. Because I'm not going to have enough time to reply to that message. Because this thing will be done when I don't expect it to be done. Which is... Apparently not true. I thought it would be done by now. Get your damn sniff. What the? I get the fact you're dying. But I'm trying to help you not die. Right, I'm holding it down this time. Look, I, you can physically see him doing his thing. Or she doing her thing. Uh, <laughs> hey. Hey. <sighs> Why are you not? Are you serious? Oh, I 
if I knew you'd be like this, I'd have every intention of making sure you die. Which is what I'm going to do now. The fact that you are physically not doing what I'm telling you to do is not making me a happy bunny. Now we're going to try and make sure either you die of hunger or you die of being getting eaten. You know, circle of life and whatnot. Happy to suffice and allow either. Right, you're sniffing properly this time, are we? We'll find out, because that jam that's turning all over the screen is getting pretty close, buddy boy. Oh, I don't know, it's not a boy, I know, but... Yeah. Why is you not sniffing? Right, I'm holding down Q. I, 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 part of me knows it's not going to work, but I'm holding it down anyway. Is it because you're too hungry? Is there a respawn for it? I don't know. So let's find out. 100%. Health report suffering. LOL. Yeah, well, that's what you get for not eating all of this free grass and food. Look at this, this is food. Can eat that. Can eat this. Can eat that. Can eat the thing that's making the screen vibrate. You can eat the whole damn tree. But no. You're too good for it. Yeah, look at this, look, it's freaking food everywhere for you. Uh, uh, I wish there was an omnivore option. Just eat everything and anything like that rock, tasty protein. I just... Uh, lay down and die. And just hurry up and die. Please. I know I can respawn, but this is this is about the journey, guys. Is it daytime yet? It's daytime! Also, I love the tet patterns, but I can't help but feel like those are scratch marks. I think they are. Ooh, what's that? Oh, it's a rock. They are scratch marks, which is kind of weird because we're getting hungry. Oh, it could be stretch marks where we've lost weight from not eating in a long time. Potentially. Potentially. Q. Alright, let's have a look at controls quickly. Eat. Oh, eat. Or left button. Why are you doing this to me? <laughs> Why? Let's cue it out again. Let's see if this works. Yeah, those are definitely scratch marks, buddy. You, um, it could be from all like the stinging nettles and the thorn bushes we've walked through. Who knows? Let's not judge this Triceratops' story. All I know is this map is too freaking huge. Like, where does everyone go? Do they just all spawn at the same time and go, oh, let's hang out together. Yay. And then others, like me, are like, where is everybody? I want to find people. Oh, no, my scent isn't working. Shock horror. And stuff like that. It's just... Ugh. I want to eat food. Can I find food? I'm just pressing E everything I walk through in case I do find something. Surely this is food. No. Apparently not. I don't even know where the water is anymore because I can't use the freaking scent. So... Boo. You're gonna die all alone. Which sounds... Quite a lot like what I was told as a fortune teller, by a fortune teller as a child, which is just not great. <laughs> not great at all. Um... Uh... I'm gonna try Ceratops that could, couldn't. Couldn't find food, couldn't find water, couldn't be of any freaking use to his herd, which he doesn't have, but still. What is that? Oh, that's the blood. I was like, oh, that little red thing's moving. Maybe it's something to sign. Um, no, it's blood. Because he is, oh, he's like cracking at the seams. It's terrifying. Like, he's falling apart at this point. Yeah, you know what? I think. Though this was about the whole journey, I think this is a great place to leave the video because my freaking god, it's been entertaining. <laughs> oh, those aren't eggs, those are toadstools. Damn it. Right, we're going to just lay down and prepare for the sweet release of death. 
So again, ladies, if you have enjoyed this video, in which case, fair play, um, then make sure to drop a like on it. If you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to my crazy video account. I'd super duper appreciate it. My name is Vertico, and you can call me V. Thank you all so much for watching. Have a nice day, and ta -ra!